As you can see, I'm on the top of probably the tallest building in Vancouver. This building has 70 floors and from up here you can see the city, Vancouver, especially the downtown. This is the downtown Vancouver on March 9, 2020. As you can see, the city is growing. They are building more structures. As you can see, there are so many cranes up in the city. That means they are constructing more buildings in this beautiful downtown. You can see the mountains at the background. You see the mountains, they have snow. People go there to ski and to have a good time. We have three main mountains close to Vancouver to ski. Over there you see down that area that is um, Seymour. This one over here right at the center, that's um, Gross Mountain. And then the one next to it, that's called Cypress. You can ski in all three of them. They are nice, but the best is Whistler, which is a little farther away. Probably you won't see it, but you can see it from there way in the background. Okay. Now you're looking down on Granville Street. That street is probably one of the most important streets in downtown Vancouver because it basically divides the city in half. From Granville Street to the left, going west, obviously that's the west side. And then, you know, when you look east, probably that's the east side of downtown where you can see, I don't know if you see that structure over there, that's um, what we call BC Place. And as you can see in the background, there's water, but that's not a river, that's the ocean. That's the Pacific Ocean because Vancouver downtown is almost like a, like a peninsula. It's surrounded by water. I wanna show you that what you see as a river over there, when you follow it, basically goes around, that's Stanley Park, and then you see the Pacific Ocean. You see that's the Pacific Ocean, and then cuts the city in another segment, the south side of the city with downtown Vancouver. Isn't that beautiful? I don't know about you, but I love my city. It's considered one of the most beautiful cities in the world because it's clean, it's safe, it has a good economic development, there's low crime rate, there's a high employment rate, the public transportation is very, very fast and very efficient. Also, medical services are very top-notch in the world. Housing is not good. Housing is it's very expensive to leave downtown Vancouver. Probably if you live in areas a little farther away, you can get maybe cheaper prices, but downtown Vancouver can be really expensive. And we're talking about one small apartment for maybe $1,500. Yeah, that's right. It's really, really expensive. All right, that was just a quick view of my city. I hope that you liked it. And uh, if you want to hear any comments, you know, if you want to hear more about it, just let me know what you want to know about this city. And if you want to give your own comments, by all means, you know, put them down so I can read them. If you want to see another area of the city, if you want to know more information about it, let me know and I'll try to, to do it for you, okay? That's it for now. Thank you for watching and see you next time. Bye-bye.